Welcome back everyone. Hope your Wednesday is going good. As you can see, we have a little different angle again. My tripod or camera holder or whatever you want to call it from five below has finally bit the dust. So I had to go back to my original one. I don't know how long I'm going to be able to use this one, but since I have a different phone, I think it will work out better. But at any rate, um, I got this in the mail today, but we're going to do this in a couple of days. It's the racing subscription box from Grand Slab Card Club. So we'll do that in a couple days. But what I wanted to do today was the flea market find of this Red Sox mystery pack. You see I paid $20 for it. Has stars and rookies and autograph and game used and all sorts of fun stuff in there. But there you see now, obviously this was one of the cards that I got the other day uh, from my Christmas in March that you seen the other day. We have a Carl Yastrzemski, um, I don't believe that's a, yeah, there's a 50 year anniversary card. And then a David Ortiz on the front. And then on the back, you have Wade Boggs, Roger Clemens, and Xander Bogarts. So let's go ahead and I'm going to rip this off screen because I just, uh, still learning my way around this old, uh, camera pod. So we'll see what we get here. Hopefully got some good stuff. I'll say the random baseball one that I got a couple, we did a few days ago, was very happy with that one. So let's go ahead and start here. We'll do it like we did the other ones. I'll just put the card there. You see Ted Williams, Carl Yastrzemski, and David Ortiz. So we'll go back to the beginning here. Go to page two, if you will. Daisuke Matsusaka, Jody Reed, 90 Fleer, and star potential Trot Nixon. So we got some nice looking cards there. Jose Canseco during his time with the Red Sox. Of course, he's uh, had time with the Texas Rangers and most notably with the Oakland A's during his time with the Bash Brothers with him and Mark McGuire. Uh, what's the name on that one? I can't read it. Roland. Rick Roland. A little difficult to read there. And Matt Barnes. Up next, we have a Jackie Bradley Jr. optic card. That's a nice looking card. Tony Armas and Shane Mack. Bruce Hurst, 1989 Tops, Gypsy Queen of Lowry. I'm not sure on the first name. I'll have to turn it over. And Tony Pena, 91 score. Let's see who the Gypsy Queen was. Uh, Jed Lowry. Not real good with baseball first names. Clay Buckles, Mike Smithson, Jeff Reardon. Some nice cards there. Mo Vaughn, Ellis Burks, Derek Lau, maybe Derek Lowe. Not sure on the pronunciation. We'll hit both just so in case we uh, do get it. Frank Rodriguez, Xander Bogarts again, a holiday card. Very nice. Does not look like a, a, a variation. And Rich Gedman, 1989 Fleer. Working on that set, but uh, that's kind of a long time project in the works. Carl Crawford, Vaughn, Vaughn Eshelman, and Calvin Schiraldi, 1987 tops. Our next row has J.D. Martinez, Mike Stanley, and Mike Boddicker, 1990 Donruss card there. Jonathan Lucroy. So is this Mike Greenwell and an 89 tops of Lee Smith. Of course, we talk about Mike Greenwell a little bit. He ran a few races in the truck series in the early 2000s. Danny Heap, Eduardo Rodriguez, and Tony Afasis. John Flaherty, Luis Rivera, or Rivera, and Jeff Facero. So getting into some guys that I'm not real familiar with, like Tom Seaver, I say that now, but I'm very familiar with Tom Seaver, Rob Hinkle, and another Mike Boddicker. Mike Greenwell once again, Christian Vasquez, and Greg Harris. Here's our autograph, Paul Tuckett Red Sox, uh, can't read that first name, or really read the last name. Uh, no more Garcia Parra, and our... Uh, Oh, very nice. Chris Sale. Very, very nice. Uh, Jersey card. I'm going to flip this one over and see who that one was. 
Bill Pulsifer. Okay, never heard of him. Obviously, it looks like a in-person or a TTM, perhaps, but still very cool. And we'll get that Chris Sale uh, sleeved up shortly. Jim Rice, nice 1989 Donruss. Bobby Jinx and Dwight Evans. So lots of nice cards in this. Carl Everett, Pat Dodson, and Wes Chamberlain. Who do we have here? We have Greg Harris, Todd Benzinger, and Pablo Sandoval. Yep, that's what I thought it said. Couldn't read it real clearly. Oh, hit my elbow on the table. John Marizano, Mike Rockford, and Ed Romero. Getting down the last handful here. Dennis Lamp, 1990 tops. Um, Scott Hattenberg, Scott Hatterberg, and Ken Ryan. Nick Isaski is up next. Another 90 Donners card. Garen Ciccini and Matt Young. Rick Cravita, Troy O'Leary, and Mike Greenwell, 87 Donruss. Got some nice Mike Greenwell cards. Don't mind that at all. Greg Blosser, Tom Bolton, 89 tops. Matt Barnes, of course. I always speak a lot of the 89 tops because that was really the set that got me started into baseball and sports card collecting. Carlos Quintana, we pulled some of those during my 89 Donruss uh, box rips. Uh, Troy O'Leary and Dwight Evans. So have a little bit of a uh, little, little more feelings and towards the 89 sets because again that's when I started really getting into the sports cards. Uh, Eric Hetzel, we have here Mo Vaughn and Colin McHugh. Colin McHugh, Steve Curry. Jose Offerman, and Jacoby Ellsbury. Looks like we've got about four or five more of these. Dennis Boyd, Aaron Sale, Adrian Gonzalez, Jason Vartek, Josh Beckett, and Jody Reed. Jack Clark, the nice Diamond Kings of Manny Ramirez. That's a nice looking card. And John Dobson. This is our next to last one, it looks like. Carlos Quintana, Danny Darwin, and Mike Marshall. And again, you've seen this at the beginning. We have Wade Boggs, Dream Team card. Got this nice Roger Clemens and a Xander Bogarts. And that one does look like a, a... Oh, it's a chrome. I thought it was a refractor. But it is a chrome. I did not notice that before. So very nice. There was our autograph card. Um, one of the Paw Tucket Red Sox guys. But that Chris Sale, really like that. Let's look at the back of it and see if that is numbered. It is not numbered, but still a really cool pull. So we've got some cards here that need to get sleeved up. So sometime in the next couple days, we'll open that Grand Slam Card Club box. I'm excited about that. I've already peeked in it, so I kind of know what packs I'm getting. So uh, I'll make you guys wait to see what I'm getting. Still have some SmackDown Live cards. Got some 2021 Donruss Baseball of course, like I said, I'm waiting to open that uh, 2021 Donruss because that stuff is so, so uh, pricey right now. I'm not going to be able to get any more in for a while, so I want to kind of sit on that. I'm not going to resell it, but I just want to sit on it so that, that way I do have something to open. And I am going to order more uh, 2016 certified and maybe some 2016 torque because if you weren't here yesterday, these were the hits out of my torque box. Actually, there's one more here. The T.J. Bell autograph. But that Hamlin was a 1 out of 15. Number 1 out of 15. Not just 1 out of 15. But it was 1 out of 15. So I got some heat in that torque box. So I may get another one. And maybe get another leaf. And maybe a, another box of some other kind. But we'll just wait and see. So anyway, I apologize for the little uh, change of angle here. But my uh, the, the little arm that I was using to hold my camera. Just decided it wasn't going to hold it anymore. Excuse me. Anyway, hope you guys enjoyed today's video. So thanks for the likes, the scubs, the, 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 scubs, the subs, and everything else. I really do appreciate it. So uh, I will see you guys again tomorrow. We'll open up something. I don't know what just yet. We'll open up something, and we'll have uh, fun doing it. So thanks for watching, guys. Enjoy the rest of your Wednesday.